Hey, what is going on guys? Thanks for checking out this video, my sports Gamatria. In this video, I'm going to go over a football game for Sunday, October 3rd, 2021. I'm going to show you highlights of each side, and it's going to be up to you to be determine who you think will win based on the numbers. I encourage you to add additional information on top of this if needed for you to feel confident in your own pick. And for some reason, if you're curious to know who I'm picking these games, you have to draw my Patreon. My picture always are writing, underlined, and italicized. For more information on that, please read the description of this video. I wish you guys the best of luck in your picks today. Let's go ahead and get to the game. We're going to be looking at the Steelers versus the Packers in Green Bay. On this side of the screen is what I call my daily numbers, date numerology, Gregorian Hebrew calendar. And then on this side of the screen is what I call my game numbers. The way that it's structured here is location up top, uh, city, state, stadium name, coordinates. Right here is the regular season head-to-head -head record between the two teams. And then right here is the home team, which is the Packers, their season record, their coach's record, their quarterback record, their name Gamatria. And then right here is the away team, their season record, their coach's record, quarterback record, their name Gamatria. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to go over some numbers that favor the Packers, and then I'm going to go over some numbers that favor the Steelers, and then it'll just be up to you to determine who you think will win. So let's first start with the Packers. If Packers were going to win this game, uh, the first thing that I would jump towards is and is that Aaron Rodgers, he's where, he wears the number 12. And uh, Steelers' Ben Roethlisberger, he wears the number 7. 12-7, 7-12. The number 127 or 127 is the 31st prime number. And so you see that I have it marked light blue. It's 31 days till Packers coach's next birthday. 127, the 31st prime number. Packers become 3 and 1. I like 31 uh, with a win for the season. 31 is the 11th prime number, and Steelers would become 1 and 1 on the road with the loss. Um, what else here? Green Bay sums to 77. The number is 77. Sums to 59. Today being the 27th day of the 7th month on the Hebrew religious, 277, the 59th prime number. Mike Tomlin, he sums to 59. Ben Roethlisberger, he sums to 277, the 59th prime. Ben Roethlisberger can get his 77th regular season loss in Green Bay. 77, 77 sums to 59. Mike Tomlin, he would get his 81st regular season loss on a day with 54 date numerology, 81 sums to 54. It's also 18 date numerology, and 81 is a reflection of 18. And then also it has 9 date numerology, and 81 has a square root of 9. 9 times 9 is 81. Um, Matt LaFleur... Sums to 129. Rodgers can get his 129th regular season win, but I don't know what would connect that number for today specifically. But just wanted to point that out. Let's see what 129 equals 100. 55, 61. Nothing, nothing jumps out really. Um, I thought I had a little bit more for the Packers side. I guess not. Lambeau Field sums to 71, the 20th prime number. Packers can become 2-0 at home for the season, like 20 in Lambeau Field. And, uh, yeah, I think that's it. I think it's the 31 connection. For Packers, the 12 and the 7, it's the 81 and the 77 Hebrew connection for Ben. But uh, let's look at the numbers for Steelers to win this game. If Aaron Rodgers loses, he becomes 28-65 in his 194th regular season start. Uh, I'm not putting too much weight into this. Oh, look, hey, Green Bay, Wisconsin sums to 257. 129, 257. 
Green Bay, Wisconsin, 257. Matt LaFleur, 129. Aaron Rodgers get us on the 29th. And Green Bay, Wisconsin. Okay, that could work. But uh, as I was saying, Aaron Rodgers, if he loses this game, he could become 128.65 for a record in his 194th regular season start. This has nothing to do with the numbers for the day. But if we want to get conspiratorial, Brian Laundry sums to 128 and 65. And he officially went missing on the uh, 14th of September, written 14 slash 9. An anagram of 194. And I know that Gabby Petito tattoo, let it be, sums to 73, 28, 116, 44, just like Packers sums to all four of those. They're identical in all four base ciphers. So if Packers were going to lose this game and Aaron Rodgers becomes 128.65, I imagine it would probably be because of that. Packers summing to the Gabby thing, 194, Brian Laundry. So it would be like a conspiratorial thing with the whole Gabby thing would be my first guess. And then it would be the 216th day of Ben Roethlisberger's current age. And 216 equals, um, or excuse me, not 216, 222 equals 216. And on the 216th day of his age, Steelers can become 2-2 two and two for the season and 2-0 and oh on the road, like 2-2-2. Two, two, two. 216, 222 sums to 216, the 216th day of Ben's age. They can become 22 and 2 and 0 for the season. Um, what else? The 147. I didn't see anything really. Unfortunately, but also with it being 216th day of Ben Roethlisberger's 39 year old age, 222 sums to 216. Steelers could become 222. If they just get become 2-2, two and two, like 22, 22 sums to 39. And again, it'll be the 216th day of his 39-year-old age. Born on March 2nd, like 3-2. 32 sums to 158, and he would pick up his 158th regular season win for his career. So I think that's what's probably what would catapult... Um, Steelers to win this game if those were the numbers that were in play. On top of that, Ben Roethlisberger sums to 182, which is a number for that Gabby case. She was Her birthday was on the 182nd day this year. She reported missing on the 182nd day of the Hebrew religious side, the ecclesiastical side of the calendar this year, 9-11. So if, Aaron, if, so if Packers lose, uh, it's going to be a, a Gabby conspiratorial thing is what I'm going to go with, a Gabby Petito conspiratorial thing. Uh, but if the Packers win... It's going to be the Hebrew thing, the 277, the 77, 59, and Green Bay 77. And then it's going to be the 12 7, 127, the 31st prime, 31 days to the coach's birthday. They become 3 and 1, like 31. Those are the two sides that I'm leaning on. Hopefully, this helps. Hopefully, it gives you some insight for the game. Uh, I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate the support. And I wish you guys the best of luck on your picks.